Long ago, I stumbled across an arcane magic. One so powerful that it could only be controlled by one monster. Quan. With his effect, I can synchro summon in my opponent's turn. Because of this, the powered Insectron's effect activates correctly. And now, I can't be destroyed. And in my turn, I can use Quan's Tuner ability again. The Synchro Summon to Black Rose Dragon. And now that the board has been cleared of your puny cards, I can use my Golden Sarcophagus to search for Thunder Dragon Duo. With his power, I can reinforce with Thunder Dragon Hawk. With Beat Down, you won't survive. And the time has finally come. To never miss. That's right, as the phoenix rises from the ashes, the thunder dragons are here to strike against the dark magician and the meta yet again. With the power of DC Diva, we can go into an alternative combo that will lay waste to the opponent's field and put us in a position of victory. Synchro Summon, Dark End Dragon, and with the power of Thunder Dragon Roar, I'll Special Summon Thunder Dragon Dark from my deck, and combined with Scrap Dragon, I'll lay waste to your back row, but that's not all. Come forth, Thunder Dragon Duo, Duelist, the time has come for you to discover that with this synchro deck, the Thunder Dragons have no limit. YT Dan Duel Links is brought to you by Dank Duelists Like You. Become a YouTube member to never miss. King of Games. Legend 1 through 7 is the ultimate test for the ultimate rogue duelist. Synchro Summon in my opponent's turn for the Insectron gives me the immortality I need 
for anime gameplay. Synchro Summon to Black Rose Dragon to Nuke Negates and to Special Summon into the Ultimate Ends. Let's go against the power of Sheer Nui. There's only one way out. My golden sarcophagus combo with the power of double tuning allows me to synchro summon Christra Corian Gandrax. Don't forget his special effect and Thunder Dragon Darks. It's the Dark Magician! Fine. Our deck is prepared for all contingencies. Your fate's been sealed. With the power of Thunder Dragon Hawk, I'll special summon Thunder Dragon Dark. Now, Synchro Summon! Samurai Destroyer. And with Thunder Dragon Roar's effect, I'll special summon another Thunder Dragon Roar. And by banishing lights and darks, I'll summon Thunder Dragon Duo. Now, beat down! Go, Samurai Destroyer! Hmm. Sealed Tombs. You're lucky. If I had the ultimate power of Golden Sarcophagus, you'd be finished in one turn. However, I'll have to settle with Quan. Hmm. When will you dark magicians learn? Your silent magician is no match. Synchro Summer! Samurai Destroyer! And Thunder Dragon Roar's effect. <laughs> Impossible. This Dark Magician's even stronger than the last. I'll have to tread lightly. Impossible! Fine. If you'll take my Samurai with your circle, I'll destroy your Dark Magician with my Treacherous! I see your strategy, and I know the perfect move to counter it. I summon Christron Quad! Attack directly, my beats! As expected, you won't defeat me with that alone. Now, Synchro Summer! Come forth! This is the ace of my synchro deck! Powered in Zetron! With Power and Zetron on the field, you won't be able to wipe out my life points. This is it. With 
this, your fate has already been determined. I'll banish one light and dark monster, the special summon Thunder Dragon Duo, even with your circle. The Thunder Dragons have the power over both the graveyard and the different dimensions. There is no limit to my Thunder Dragon's power. And I'll show you now by special summoning back Thunder Dragon Roar. And using a Thunder Dragon Roar in my hand to reclaim Thunder Dragon Duo. Now, face my beatdown! You are a duelist of remarkable skill. But as long as you play the Dark Magician, you'll never be able to touch me. I told you, my thunder dragons have no limits. We're going to be getting in there for King of Games, my boys. You guys have probably already seen and this is KLG for the last season. This season, I am targeting a new power for KLG. So I'm gonna try my hardest not to clap with Thunder Dragons this season. Um, but as you guys have seen, Thunder Dragons have unlimited potential. And right now, they are definitely at their strongest with new cards in the meta, like Light Swarm that promotes um, a one-turn surprise OTK coming from Judgment Dragon. Cards like Powered and Zektron is the perfect counter to stop that combo flat, and then you can retaliate with the absolute most powerful retaliation of Christron Corian Gandrax, banishing both the Judgment Dragon and the Monster Normal Summon to swing in for game. It's just a powerful combo, a powerful combination, and the right time for this deck in Duel Links. Now, this is the Thunder Dragon Never Miss deck with insane powers that you have never seen before i mean of course you've seen it before i've dueled with this deck on many a live stream and videos i've showed you guys the power of this deck over and over and over again but as i always do with like the hazy flame deck each deck requires an upgrade per meta and this meta we had to upgrade to a deck that can stop the dark magician now why would you say i need to build it to stop dark magician and not other things well, the Dark Magician set the bar very high for this meta. The Dark Magician has become um, a powerful deck that has has that literally is a master of not only the OTK, but control. The Dark Magician can summon three monsters in one turn and attack for game. Also, the Dark Magician can summon three monsters, attack, miss, and still have control over the field and have a strong negate and disruption on their side. So in order to beat that, you need to have a deck that can do just the same, build a very strong board that's hard to completely wipe away. And also at that same time, you need to maintain some sort of control over the duel and not let your opponent get away with murder by playing everything that they can from the grave and the field and the hand. The reason why I think this deck is just absolutely incredible is because it contains two board wipes you know, you have Black Rose Dragon and Christron Corian Gandrax. And then you also have board breakers like Scrap Dragon, Samurai Destroyer, and also Dark End Dragon. Now, the reason why you guys might wonder why am I using Black Rose Dragon and I was so adamant about not using it before. Honestly, the reason why I didn't use it before is because my previous rank ups and my previous duels, even online, random U bells have been popping up. And a random you bail at the wrong time, especially against this deck, can really put you in a, a bad situation. So it's easy to just deal with a you bail deck with Samurai Destroyer, which is why he stayed in. But also the reason why I end up taking out Red Dragon Archfiend is because there's no more defensive decks. Due to the Dark Magician, there aren't too many decks that run a bunch of stuff in defense mode, except for um, Super Heavy Samurai, and those aren't in the meta frequent enough for me to even worry about that with an actual synchro designation. And the MVP of this deck, this deck will not be the same if you did not have power than Zektron, that's 100% for sure. 
Pirate and Zectron is a level six synchro monster that you can use Chris Drawn Quan to synchro summon it in your opponent's turn using Thunder Dragon monsters from your hand. And the Thunder Dragon monster you'll use is Thunder Dragon Dark. And by synchro summoning with Thunder Dragon Dark, you can always search the deck for the perfect card to contribute to your OTK combo on turn three. It allows you to set up the perfect strategy to retaliate. On turn three, you should have an extra card. Maybe you've gotten into the deck a little bit and you've seen your Night Beam. You have Night Beam in hand, you have Duo in hand, you have Deep Sea Diva in hand. It is game. It's time to win this duel. So by using Night Beam, we can stop the Dark Magician from using his trap cards to special summon more Dark Magicians from the hand and go, go insane pluses with circle and also because these monsters effects goes off when they're either banished or destroyed even if circle catches them it is not a true detriment also when circle banishes things like thunder dragon duo we can bring him back to life with thunder dragon hawk however we can also restore him to our hand with thunder dragon war and then banish a light and dark from the grave to special summon him yet again and guess what Powered in Zectron is a light monster. So you guys got to get on this deck. And if you don't, you're just going to miss. So enjoy my KOG rank up duel. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. If you missed or skipped the beginning part of the duels or beginning part of this video just to see this part, go back and watch the first part. It's amazing. But if you don't, you missed. And as always, keep it. Dang. This is it. Our final duel! Nani? Break. My final duel. I've been saved. It's Quan. And this brick won't hold the L. My brick hand. Saved by the Beast Quan. Nani. Trap Lair, Odeon, Black Wings. What? Trap Lair. Impossible. What kind of deck is this? I must be careful. Things could get treacherous. Hmm. Let's go. That oh, looks like it's gonna be an easy clap. I may have bricked, but I'm never gonna miss. I'm using Thunder Dragon Hawk's effect. Come on, that treacherous trap hole won't help you. Let's go. That treacherous trap won't help. Let's go. Unless he has the Black Wing Counter Trap. Normal summon. He's got something back there. But what? I'll test his strength with this. Come forth! Deep Sea Diva sings a song of destruction to bring forth a new power that can never miss. Scrap Dragon! Now! Thunder Dragon Roar's effect activates, allowing me to special summon a Thunder Dragon monster from my deck to the field. And I'll special summon. Duelist. The time has come for the Thunder Dragons to take their place at the top as king. As they finally lay to rest, the tier one meta of the Dark Magician and the most powerful rogue decks of all time. But now as we move into this new meta, we hope to unlock new powers. So, in order to join me and learn the power of the never miss, like this video and subscribe.